Hello everybody, I'm Drew Muxlow, and this little guy is Dieter. He won't be teaching you how to draw a dog today, but I will. You ready? Get out your pen and paper, and let's go. The first step of this drawing is to draw the head. Start out by doing a semicircle for the forehead, and a long snout. It should roughly be the shape of a scotch tape holder. Now, after you've done that, continue on to the second step, which is the torso. It should be very long and roughly the shape of a hot dog, due to the fact that we are drawing a wiener dog. After that, continue on to the third step, which is the limbs. Start off with the back hind leg than the other one. After that, draw a curvy tail in the back. Now, I don't know, maybe that's not actually considered a limb, but I'm including it in this step anyway. Then proceed to draw the front legs. Now step four, just darken the outline. This all should have been a light sketch with a pencil, so all the parts that you're proud of and want to keep, make sure you make extremely dark when you're outlining. This should be one of the longest steps. Some fun facts about dachshunds while you're still darkening that outline. One of them, there are over 15 different colors that they come in and three different sizes. Dachshunds are known as badger hounds because it comes from the German word dox, translating to badger, and hund, translating to hound. These German dogs were bred to hunt badgers, extremely feisty creatures. Dachshunds were bred to have long bodies for optimal tunneling techniques. A full-grown dachshund can actually completely immerse himself in the ground within two minutes. Two minutes? That's crazy. They have loose skin so it doesn't get caught while tunneling, long ears, and a long, strong tail so that a owner can pull it out without hurting it. By now you should have finished darkening the outline, so step number five is to add some details. This includes the eyes, nose, mouth, whiskers, and stuff like that. The eye can just be a U-shape, make it really easy, have the impression of a closed eye. Then continue on to darken the nose and the mouth. If you want, you can add some ear scruff, and you can add some whiskers. Step six is the final step, which is just erasing the excess lines. Any of the outlining that you did that you do not want, just erase, and you have your final product. Now, isn't that a wonderful doggo? If you want to get extra spicy, you can add a few details just to increase the depth a little bit more. And there you go. Now you have your very own beautiful wiener dog. I hope you enjoyed. <laughs>